Hello, welcome back. Last time I did the treasure room. So no wonder I thought this thing's name was treasure, because look at where my cursor was. Like, if it's if it's anywhere near this thing, it just says treasure, but that's the name of the zone. Okay, that's slightly confusing. Anyway, I don't need to be here yet, because I have bonuses to look at. Uh, how the additional characters were created. I saw that already. So I got four new starfish. New picture. New picture. It involves a crab. I believe it's king crab. Yep. I see the chains and stuff. Uh, okay, that's a start. Somehow, maybe. These pieces are very small. Uh, I see where that goes. Like this. Okay, I'm gonna guess lower right for this. It's definitely in the bottom, because I see sand. Where's the, the rest of those letters? Those should be easy enough to spot, although they'll be right at the bottom border. Drag and drop pieces to build the picture. Right click to break a finished part. Thanks. What do you think I've been doing? <laughs> uh, if it's in the bottom border, like this, this draws sort of a little uh, beveled bo Is that the right word? Um, anyway, a border of sorts. So I think that might actually be covering up the bottom of the letters, unless this is... That is. Okay, I can just barely see them. It's going to be pretty hard to spot any others, though. But apparently I'm still trying. Okay, anyway. Um, do these... Okay, I see a crab leg. Does this connect in any way here? Not like that. Oh boy, this is just a big mess of crab parts. <clears throat> Making any sense of them is going to be pretty hard. Where do I even start with this? There? Okay. Like, okay, that's part of his face. Right? Mm-hmm. Okay, that's part of his knee, one of them. How many legs do crabs have? I don't actually know this off the top of my head. It's probably four. Maybe it's not, though. I've, I've never paid attention, I'm just realizing. <laughs> Uh, do you go on the bottom, maybe? Uh, can't tell for sure. Well, you're not connecting to that. Okay, so here's his dollar sign. That goes... Surely that goes in one of these places. Probably here. Mm. Ah, this is all confusing. Let's work on some foliage and stuff. What does that say? Boss? Now, hang on. How much jewelry does he have, exactly? I thought it was... I see the chain. I thought this was on the chain in the center. So, once again, I'm realizing I haven't really paid attention to... what King Crab looks like and what he wears. Okay, so this must not go there. Because this connects th to that. Where's the rest of the chain? There we go. You might be up above, I guess. It's possible. Okay, so that looks like chain. There we go. Umbrella. Okay, umbrella has part of a crab knee on it. I think it's that crab knee. Oh, no, no, it's not. Uh, what part of him is blue? That part. Face. That's not really blue. It's just the lighting, I guess. Do you go together somehow? Yes. Uh, cool. There we go. That's helpful. So I think that's all the way on the right. This probably goes here. Why can't you? Because of that. And that. Still? It's not connecting. Aha! That's lower left. Okay. I should have figured I want to know what's up with this dollar sign. Where does he have a dollar sign that's not on his medallion, or whatever you call that? And what's that thing? Hm. Okay, chain. That was... Pure luck. 
Um, okay, that was also pure luck. Ugh. All this stuff. It's just hard for my eyes to process. There we go. Speaking of eyes, where's the rest of your left, right eye? Is that... what is that? I have no idea what I'm looking at here. What could that possibly be? It's part of this, apparently. There's his eye. Uh, hmm. Shouldn't this go, like, here-ish? I guess not. Where would that go then? Here? No. So that looks to me like it goes here, yes. I want to get this piece. Should be, like, lower left magenta something. It's not... Like, it looks kind of like those two, but it's neither of those, apparently. This? Yeah. Ugh. This is hard. <laughs> what else can I work on at the moment? What's this? This is not anything that I'm seeing in the rest of this picture. It's like a metal texture. Okay. What what are you? Where do you go? Not up in the sky, clearly. Not there. Not there. So you must be on the right side, then. But how would that make any sense? I... what? Uh... no, you're not there. Hmm. Aha! Part of a claw. Where's the other part of that claw? That's not it. That's it. Okay, so boss there. Where's his mouth? That's his mouth. Trees. Trees go... Okay, so this must be here then. Yeah, that follows that curve, I see. Nice. Nice. So where could you go? Could you be here? You could. Okay. I see the curve now. So that's part of a leg. Still don't have a home for this. Is it over here? It is. Oh, that's not part of his... Okay, I recognize this. This lighter was part of a puzzle. Um, the one where... Uh, I had I was waking somebody up, wasn't I? Or was this where I was waking King Crab up? I remember a lighter up on top of a rock. There was water down below. I think it had Flounder and Virgil in it. Hmm. Don't remember much else about that puzzle, though. Okay, so what is this? What piece goes here? This piece. No. This piece? Right. Concave curve instead of convex. Right, here should be maybe... probably not that. No. Ugh. Where's the rest of your face? Is that your face? No. Is that? That's not. Do you have more of a face? Like, shouldn't, shouldn't there be... Oh, I did it by accident. Okay. Okay. Getting closer. That must be there. Okay, there we go. That was pretty hard. And I have another to do. Oh boy. It involves Shelby. Possibly both of them. 
looks like it. Hmm. Not much else identifiable. I see Shelby and Bricks. That's about it. How is this not connecting to you? Oh, it's part of you. I see. Move. All right, are you two close to each other? They're very close. They're best of friends. But like in proximity. This is not on the bottom definitely because that's not that's not complete. This looks like upper right to me. Yeah, I think that's right. Okay, I see a chain. That's at least an identifiable element. Chain hangs like that. Is there more of it? Based on the way I see that this wall is going... Hmm. Actually, I'm not sure what conclusions I could draw from that. That's part of a snail. There we go. Okay, that's how you two join. Just just go there. Just go there. Just why why can't you just go there? There we go. I had to Oh wait, uh here. There we go. I had to do the horizontal and vertical separately for some reason. Uh okay, so rest of a chain maybe. Also there's there's something here. What are what are these things? That's a chest maybe? That's the that's an archway. Where's there an archway? Okay, so I'm not convinced anymore that this is necessarily... Oh, okay, no, it's a barrel. Uh, not convinced anymore that this is necessarily in the upper right. Oh, yeah, so I think, actually, I see how these join. Yeah, that's what I thought. So maybe it's top center. Okay, so there are only two... Hmm. Hmm. Uh, okay, I'm going to have to break some stuff apart, I guess. That's unfortunate. These are some big pieces. I guess I'll break that one. I had another one of these joined up somehow. Like, right here. There we go. Well, that's not that's not how it was, but that's how it is now. Oh, here we go. Hmm. And now just unidentifi un unidentifiable brick patterns. Right, these this is still not joined to this. Um, I guess technically you could go on the bottom, but that wouldn't make any sense to me. Um... I think this is actually the bottom here. Yeah, that feels good with that being the corner. You look like you connect to that. But you don't. So, oh yeah, you do. Bigger bricks, farther left. Bluer bricks. Where? Way in the back, it would seem like, but that doesn't... Now, hang on, where could you possibly go? Because it looks like there's this wall that has that dark... Wait. No, no, this is still not connected. <laughs> ah. Okay, but that's where it connects. I can clearly see that this this is, this is this corner is, is correct here. Uh, okay, so that's upper left. That seems awfully close to the left side. That's not... Really? Oh, there we go. Okay, archway, 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 archway there. Ceiling, ceiling. You look like you are, okay. Floor. Large bricks on the left. Now wait, you're not, you don't connect there? I guess you're, wait. If you don't connect there... Wait, you don't connect here. So, like this. Or this. There we go. Okay. Getting there. 
getting there quickly. What's that dark? Way down here? Mm -hmm. Floor. Who's a floor? You're a floor. You're not a floor. You're a floor. What are you, then? Oh, you are a floor, just a different part of it. Okay. Nice. Okay. Well, there's half a video done. <laughs> uh, another video from dialogue recording section. Also, unused mission. Buried seahorse. Let's see this video first. Those are always fun. Haha! <laughs> Didn't kill me. I have a hit in this. I have a hit in this exoskeleton. <laughs> I have a hit in this exo. <laughs> I have a hit in this exoskeleton. <laughs> I have a chip in this exoskeleton. I have a chip in this exoskeleton. Yeah! Getting there. Virgil's voice always sounds like there's a... a thing applied to it that changes the... Uh, you know, it, it, ha it has that characteristic artifacting you get when you try to change the speed of uh, an audio clip without changing the, the pitch. Or vice versa. So was it pitched up or down, or was it... No, it wasn't pitched up or down. It sounds too natural for that. It's just like he was talking way faster and they slowed it down, or talking way slower and they sped it up or something. That's what I think I'm hearing. Uh, unused mission. Let's at least peek at it and see what, what it says about it. Rooms. Was it... Is it this? Buried seahorse. Okay, so no actual graphics for this stuff. Um, this is all... Oh, none of these are seaweed pushable. It's just uh, just Guppy digging him out. So I do need to remember, if I'm not doing these now, which I'm probably not because this looks like a pain. Yeah, that whole thing has to move for him to get out. I do need to remember that these unused rooms are a thing that I would need to come back for if I want complete... 100% completion on everything. Three pack. I should look at that again someday soonish. It's been a while. Alright, so there's definitely not anything left <laughs> that I can do in 15 minutes, probably. Unless, like, I left behind a really easy. I almost said seahorse, uh, starfish somewhere. Probably haven't. Risky King Crab. Is this the mission I was thinking it was? With the lighter? Yeah, this is the one I was remembering. Okay, so, oh yeah, and that's that statue. All right, so that, that painting depicted King Crab having just been rescued. Oh, and there was a little video clip of that too, so it was probably from the same same sort of thing. Anyway, uh, get the password is the mission I want to work on, so let's at least see if I can gain a little bit of understanding of it. I'm not sure this fake login screen is such a good idea. It's against the rules, and I doubt it will fool the hacker. Patience, Guppy. He'll come. So last time Someone's I was here... logging in. Oh yeah. The evil program. That oh, sounds like our man. Yes. And now his password. Gah! It's encrypted. Let's take it with us. Maybe we can decode it later. Okay. So last time I was here, somebody told me that it doesn't actually matter what this code does. That doesn't influence the puzzle. Um, so I don't need to worry about writing some kind of code to do something here. Just get the password out of here. So my interpretation of this would be... Oh. Okay, so nobody... They didn't explicitly tell me the goal, but I think I can infer. Since there are no exits that Flounder, at the very least, can use, I think I just need to get this object down here. That's all that's necessary. Okay. Um... Yeah, only the Shelbys are able to leave. And like, maybe Guppy if she can get a, some kind of protection from this and swim through there and go down that, but that seems unnecessary. Okay, so I have a trapped snail here. I, haven't, I didn't save any states last time I tried this. Hmm. Flounder cannot get over here to push this pipe. That pipe's just going to stay there. All right, I think I see roughly what I need to do. 
Okay, so let's start with, um, all right, which Shelby are you? You're that one. Not again. That's gonna hurt her. Okay, so that's protection, good. Hmm. So the... Hmm. <laughs> my, my. What is it? It looks like this program is stuck in an infinite loop. I'll fix it for you. That might help you with the password. You can fix it? Oh, yes. Shelby and I went to night school. We are certified software developers. All right, that seemed useful. This thing needs to get out of the way. Um, I need a snail's help with that. Okay, that's a start. Now what do I want to do? I don't know. I don't. I don't know what I want to do here. So I'm just kind of doing stuff. I know I want to take this with me. Okay, so that's something. So here, why don't you go onto that, and I'll push that over there. Um, or not. Well, I'm gonna need your help on this thing, because I need it in another place. And now, okay, so hang on. Like, obviously this is supposed to go in there, I guess. Um, so if I were to do this... Uh, I did this before, last time I tried this puzzle. So if I do that, though, it would mean that that part falls down here. Okay, that fixed it. Now this can't get out of the way. I don't think I'm going to let it fall down there. Because, yeah, now that's just kind of in the way. Um, I guess I could push it back left, but I need to get the password through here. Now, how could I do that? I think it, the only way the password's getting through is in that row, isn't it? But that can't work. This is all radioactive. This one's not radioactive. But it doesn't matter because the one above is. Hmm. I seem to remember last time I was here, I did manage to rescue this snail. How could that have been? What does Flounder need to do? I don't know. Hmm. Maybe instead of doing stuff, I should have been just analyzing. So what do I need? Flounder can swim through here with some minor difficulty. Has to go back and forth a little bit. So everybody can... Oh, that's a problem for snails, though. So snails need some assistance getting through here. Lasers in the way, kinda. If I could just drop one thing down here... Okay, so what do I do about this problem? I have two snails, eventually, if I, if I can get rid of this. I can get a, sna a second snail out. Okay, so obviously a goal of mine is to rescue Shelby number two over here. How would I do that? Um, what if, instead of pushing that all the way out, well, hmm. How is this ever going to move through here? It seems like it has to go through there, because if I, if I plop it down here, I have no pushing power of any sort. So that password's gonna have to make it through there, okay? How will that happen? Okay, so that's how it came up initially. I'm gonna stash it here for the moment. That's probably not the best idea though. Eh, it might be fine. Mm -hmm. 
Okay, I see something I can maybe do. Gotta think with snails here. Uh, no, none of this works. Hmm. I want to just push that through there. And that's what I'm trying to do. It's not very doable, though. Okay. I'm trying to get this ahead of that so I can push it through there before that falls off, but maybe that's impossible. Uh, here, you don't stick to that. Stick to that instead. Um... Hmm. Yeah, I'm getting the same sense I got last time I looked at this puzzle. It's just, it's it's one of those where I just have no idea where to even begin. Like, I know I gotta drop this down here. Or, no, not true. I need to... I need to get it through here because it's... It can't move through... Wait, can it? Um, well, it can't get through this gap. This pipe could fall if Guppy had pushed that aside with Shelby's assist assistance, because Shelby is indestructible, although... Even so, that's not of the right shape to be doing that sort of... Th okay, no. I think this just stays here, but then... I don't know. I don't know anything, apparently. Uh, I want at least some understanding. I'm going to get this. If I can get this here, then I'll be happy. So let's start with this, maybe? So yeah, what if I did that? Here, you. Stop. Stop doing stuff. I'm busy. Hmm. Maybe? Maybe not. Hmm. I guess you could crawl all the way around. And I guess you're going to have to. Well, now wait, how will that help me? And also, you don't have to do that, because you can just do this instead. But still, how would that help me? It doesn't seem to. I want to get a hit, uh, uh, Shelby on the bottom of this so I can push it to the right. But there's no crawling through that unless... Well, okay, so if I did this, then I guess that becomes possible. Oh, Shelby, what happened to you? I crawled into this procedure, and now I can't get out. I guess I'm the wrong type of snail. <laughs> okay, so you die if you go there. Okay, so... Alright, I'm starting starting to understand. That's why I have to replace this with this, because this does have to get ahead of it. So what I, what I was trying to do was the correct thing, because there's no way to push this through here unless I have assistance from something like that. Okay. So I need to get that ahead of that somehow. Alright, this is probably already not having done something important here, but this is... It would be kind of nasty if I had to do something to this, because this is what I would do at the very beginning of the puzzle, and it would affect something at the very end. No, I think I need to not drop this pipe, because if the pipe goes down there, then that's never lifting off. I need to push this to the right, get out of the way, the ice floats up here, this sits... Oh no, it's more complicated than that. Um... 
No, no, it's fine. This goes in this space. So uh, one, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. Ice floats up. Password. With a little bit of snail assist. Well, no, that wouldn't work. A problem that I'm going to have, if I've done that, and I'm trying to shove the password down here, just working backwards, is that the password's going to fall and be on that. I could use a snail to push it further, but the snail would die on the way down, so that's no good. Unless this is involved. So like, snail here, this block here, that's protection, those all fall together, Shelby doesn't die to lasers, password gets out and down. Okay. Assuming this could get over there. That doesn't seem impossible, from at a glance at least. Okay, so I've, I've convinced myself I don't need to mess with this. It's better to leave it as it is. But I do need to get this in here, insert that in that slot before I do other stuff. But how do I push it past this point? It feels like I want Guppy on the other side. Can I do that? Yes. Yes. Like this. Um, like this. There we go. That's something. Is it what I want, though? Uh, now I need to elevate it. How would I do such a thing? I can't. So the only other way that would work is a way that doesn't make much sense to me. Um, I'd have to put it on top of this. And then, well, actually, no, that could maybe work. All right, so I'll put it on top of that. You go over here. Shelby sticks to this, and this goes down here. Now what? Uh, now everything kind of works itself out, partially. Not really, though. No, it really doesn't. Hmm. I can push this further over here and make it impossible to lift that up anymore. Ah! Wait, what if I push that the other way? There we go, now stuff's happening. Okay. Okay, this is what I needed. I got it. Um, kind of. Kind of, but not quite. Hmm. Hmm. Maybe this can work? No, it can't. Can it? Maybe it can. Sure it can, just like this. Oh man. Snail gymnastics. Complicated stuff. There we go, I did it! And I'm pretty sure that's still retrievable. Nice. Good start. This would be retrievable like this. Oops. Uh, sure, that's a good way to do it. Nice. All right, so that's progress, sort of. Now, I feel like it's necessary to do something over here to prevent that from falling all the way down there, but I'm not sure what thing that would... Well, I guess I can have Shelby just sort of sit under it. That would work. Kind of. Uh, you're on the wrong surface. I guess... I don't want you, go to, I, I, I don't want you to go all the way around, because that's a pain. Um... That doesn't seem too great. 
It does give me the opportunity to do this, though. Yeah, this this is probably what I want. And now, again, I'm having the feeling that I already did this the first time I looked at this puzzle. This feels very familiar. Uh, shoot. If I could move this up one more, then I could push all that to the right and get Shelby out of there. But the password's in the way now. Okay, well, um... Boy, this is complicated. I knew I wasn't going to get much of anywhere with the amount of time I had to spend on it. I gained some understanding. I, I got the password kind of over here where I wanted it, so I guess I'll be satisfied with that for the day. Okay, see you next time to hopefully get some actual understanding here and uh, get this password out of here.